Hello, Namaste, Salam Walekum. Welcome to another session of Be Fit, Be Cool campaign by AAPI, the American Association of Physicians of Indian Origin. You know, they're working very hard to make sure we all understand the concept, the mantra of Be Fit, Be Cool. So, today I'm going to show you a very simple clear soups. See, one thing great about clear soups is you cannot add any fat into it because they have to remain clear. But today, the way I'm doing it, very simple way, it is going to be super, super tasty. For this, first I'm going to add some lemongrass. Today I'm going to do lemon coriander soup. For this, I'm going to use some lemongrass. So, I've just chopped some lemongrass. Uh, you can use, uh, you know, the dried lemongrass that is available in bottles to give a very nice flavor to dish. What I've done is I'm taking this in a nice strainer. After lemongrass, I'm going to take some coriander stems to give a very nice flavor. In this, you can also add just of lemon or sweet lemon so that you know make sure that the just is not too bitter and now this lemongrass and the coriander leaves let it infuse to give a nice flavor to this stock already i'm getting a very nice mild aroma now the stock is simmering i want to make some wontons that can go into the soup but we're going to fill this wonton with all rainbow colored vegetables in this, you don't need to add any oil. So, I'm going to use all the colored vegetables first. The mushroom, I've got garlic, ginger. You can add all the vegetables. But if you want to saute the garlic and ginger, a little bit you can. But I'm just uh, going to add all of them. The cabbage, you want to use the Chinese cabbage is also fine. Add finely chopped carrot, green chili. You can uh, do this in a non-stick pan so it doesn't stick at the bottom. So it will be much more easier. We are going to let them cool a little bit and then we are going to add some spring onions. We are going to let this cook for a few minutes. Then we are going to add spring onion, all these vegetables in this. And now we are going to season it with a little bit of salt, crushed pepper is very good. Wow, you know all of this giving a very nice aroma. But what we do is after these vegetables get a little bit soggy, you know as a stuffing, lot of people add cheese and all these things but all we are going to do is add a little bit of cornstarch so you will be able to make it into a you know small dumplings to go into your wontons so while once these cook little bit all you're going to do is sprinkle a little bit of uh, cornstarch cook this then this is all going to become like a mass which you're going to use as a stuffing in your wonton all the awesome vegetables ah very nice aroma coming from this. If you want, you can also use your most liking herb into this. That will give the enhanced flavor. In the last, we are going to add some soya sauce. That is where there is going to be some salt. So when you add salt in the beginning, just make sure you be very careful and not add too much. Now you can see this is going to become like a lump that can go into your wontons. I have made this mixture that goes into the wonton purely vegetarian. But if you want to add shrimp, chicken, anything you can add into this. Now, you know, to make this wonton sheet, I'm going to make it very simple just with flour. And uh, I'm going to add a little bit of turmeric to give a nice uh, color. But, you know, for this flour, I'm going to use the gluten rich flour. But if you don't get it, you can also add a little bit of egg into the flour and make your wonton sheet. So, add and add very little water, make into a dough and uh, just roll it like thin chapatis and then we will be able to make uh, our wonton sheets. You know, make a tough dough, that way your wontons will come out perfect. After you roll the sheet, just uh, cut your wontons round. You know, you can make any shape. You want to cut into squares and do it. You know, the fun thing is get your kids involved and make fancy shapes which they will like. Wow, that should be okay. I can make them small and you know, the rest of the dough, you can always mix it back again, rest it and again roll it. We have cut this dough into small roundels. Then we are going to take some of the mixture, what we have and then we are going to make our own wontons. You know, making them is very easy. Just wet it so that you can seal it. Not too much water too. Now, all you do is just make sure you stuff the mixture properly and seal the edges. Okay, isn't this very simple? You know, kids especially get excited when you give them wantons or anything and at the same time 
just put little bit of moisture on the edges and then we are going to do a fold. So, it is very simple you can bring both the edges and connect it here. You can do outwards, inwards there is no problem just wet the edges look at this fold it get them like this either way it they will come out very simple. Now, lot of flavor has been pulled from this coriander, lemongrass and now you can see a oh, lot of mild but awesome flavors in this. I am going to reduce the flame and we are going to season it. All white seasonings what I call sugar, salt and tasting salt. Now, I am going to mix all of this. Now, we are going to drop in our wontons 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. You know I am making soup for myself today and we are going to squeeze in some lime juice, but do not add too much just right enough for good taste. Now, we are going to let this cook for 3 to 4 minutes the wontons also will be nicely cooked and perfect. Mm. Wow, I am going to show you the last trick that we are going to add in this. Now, once you see the wontons floating on top that is good enough they are cooked. You know do not cook too much I or else they will break. First we are going to have few pieces of wonton here ok that should be good and then we are going to put in some coriander. On top of it we are going to add some of the stock on. See because you have seen when the stock was getting ready it was slightly green, but the moment I added little lemon juice it got uh, again back to uh, light color. So, uh, 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 that is it. Now, the soup is all ready with wontons filled with lot of good vegetables. Dear friends very simple without a drop of oil you can make many varieties of clear soups. When we go to the restaurants they charge tons of money to give you this soup, but you have seen how easy it is to make and your kids will enjoy. For me few pieces of shrimp would have been blessing, but even this it will be going to be even you know for me few pieces of shrimp into this wontons would have been awesome, but I am going to enjoy it like this also. Only thing we need to be careful about is this wonton you know the inside will be very very hot. So, be careful when you bite into this hot hot wontons. Wow really really fuming hot ideally I would have used clear chicken stock or any other stock even vegetable stock also you can add, but I try to make it very simple. So, you can make it and this is going to be tasty full of flavor. Hmm. Perfect lemon coriander soup super. Whenever you enjoy these kind of soups say one mantra be fit be cool. See you in another session bye bye Kudafis.